Try this on Google. Type Garden City India and what you get is Bangalore. The city houses over 8.4 million people, approximately half the population of the Netherlands. Struggling to cope with its rapid growth, the city has acquired another epithet. Though estimates vary, Bangalore produces 3,000 to 4,000 tons of solid waste every day. For the past decade, Bangalore has dumped its waste in different landfills. With environmental and health hazards, citizens protesting and activists shouting themselves hoarse, the authorities were forced to rethink this unsustainable model. In 2012, the city adopted a decentralized model. The idea was, manage waste at the local level. Wet or organic waste could be made into compost and dry recyclable waste could be sent to a local dry waste collection center. To implement the decentralized system, dry waste collection centers or DWCCs are being set up in every ward. DWCCs try to create a formal economy around dry recyclable waste. Some DWCCs employ people who were previously in the informal sector, thereby granting them legitimacy. Will this new model work? Rubbish or Kasu Kasa is a game that drops you right in the middle of this unfolding situation. A bilingual game, it supports both English and Kannada. You need a group of four to six players. Each player assumes the role of a DWCC manager. You can invest in creating new DWCCs and trade in dry waste. Any waste you do not collect goes to the landfill. If the landfill gets full, all players lose. If you collectively build a DWCC in every ward, you all win the game. By playing the game, you experience firsthand what it takes to be a DWCC manager. The day-to-day -day frustrations, the tiny joys and the bigger picture. The push and pull of the economy and the environment, people, their attitudes and even their apathy. We challenge you to tackle Bangalore's waste crisis. Can you reclaim the garden city?